R.A. Dickey and Johan Santana both obviously did incredible things in the year 2012. One won a Cy Young, one threw a no-hitter. Which was more improbable, Steve? I think I'm going to have to go with the R.A. Dickey Cy Young, even though Santana was coming back from the surgery and, and was only a few starts in from that. So, you no, know, that certainly wasn't likely. But given Johan Santana's stature and given the fact that he had that filthy changeup that you could kind of see getting deeper into the game, just like he did, still being very effective, maybe being more effective. I think the fact that R.A. Dickey had one season where he was an all-star, won the Cy Young, got MVP votes. No other year in his career did he touch any of that. That, to me, is the most improbable of the two. Yeah, I mean, I completely understand where you're going with that, Gilbs. I really do. And I, I don't it, – it was very improbable. But I'm going to go with Santana's no-hitter only because – the fact that it's the only one that's been thrown in the history of the franchise, um, you know, because he was coming off some of the injuries that he was coming off of, because he had struggled at times, uh, you know, coming off some of those injuries and some of the starts, and the fact that he was able to go so long into the game, he hadn't really shown that he could do that again since he was injured. Um, and Dickey throwing it at, at City Field um, with the wind kind of blowing in his face and the knuckleball, and it helped him a little bit. You know, I mean, he had to do it on the road, too, obviously, to win a Cy Young, but uh, pretty cool. Either one was improbable. Well, I'm going to be the tiebreaker here, and I have to think you guys both have great arguments. But as a tiebreaker, I'm going to go with Gelbs on this one. And, and I think the most improbable was R.A. Dickey, um, only because of the things that you already mentioned, which is Santana had that ability to throw a no-hitter. He'd been close um, before, so it wasn't that shocking that he was able to throw it. The fact that the Mets had never had one made it a little – less probable, I guess, although you can say the odds were with them to finally have one thrown in a Met uniform. But R.A. Dickey winning the Cy Young, I don't think anybody saw that coming. 